the name Gold Coast passes, long live Ghana. Joyful citizens of the new state celebrate their independence in the most African of all ways by dancing till they're ready to drop. But though it's not the Gold Coast any longer, it's still on the coast. And the fishermen who make up so much of Ghana's population mark the day in their own manner. No celebration is complete without a beauty queen, of course. The people of Ghana see their freedom as more than a local triumph, for they are now the only all-African dominion in the British Commonwealth, a position of great responsibility. Through the festivities runs a more serious note, typified by the ceremony at Ghana's fine university, visited by the Duchess of Kent, the Queen's representative at the independent celebrations. The Duchess also attends some of the rather less formal rejoicings. Outside Parliament House, crowds acclaim the hero of the hour, Dr. Nkrumah, the Prime Minister. And since everyone's dancing, why shouldn't he?